Yo, what's going on guys, DJS here, and I'm going to go ahead and do a live commentary through this uh, this gameplay here. We'll see how far we get, I don't know. Um, this is going to definitely be in a handful of parts. I'm probably going to do about 20 minute gameplays per uh, walkthrough video or let's play video. So uh, yeah, we'll see what we do here. I usually, usually don't do live commentaries because I can't focus. Uh, <laughs> I, I usually just focus too much and then I just... Uh, or I'll end up dying, but I uh, I don't know what to expect here. It looks like I'm on? Billy this time. Sal, this game, if you didn't know, like the you first here? the first six rounds right. is like super critical. Just trying to get everything get lined here. up for the first six rounds, uh, because by by round six I could have the Hell's Retriever, the Blunder Gat, and uh, make my way all over to. I have all the buildables done. So the first 20, I think the first 20 minutes or the first two episodes is just going to be a lot of compiling everything and getting everything set. So if you guys don't know, right here now, these guys are starting to come in. Now I collect my 2x right here. And then I go ahead and kill these guys. And then that way I get double points for killing these guys. I did a strategy guide on it. I hope it goes viral. I hope, really hope it gets a lot of points because I was one of the first people to, to do it like this. Um, and not this part of it, I'll show you up coming up. So I can see right here if I hit select, I had killed five people. So I know there's six zombies. Don't want to kill the last one. Gonna run out here, and luckily for me, the key's on this side. So I'm gonna go over here, electrocute myself, and go into afterlife mode. And then this first jump right here is always so tricky. I don't know why sometimes I can't make this up, these jumps. I don't know if you guys have that problem or not. But I always, sometimes I'll sit up there and try to jump up there like two or three times. I'm like, man, what the heck? I can't get up there. And then I'm going to go shock this guy right here. Open up that door right there. And then the last one. This is a really cool one too. You don't have to run all the way up and around. You just turn around and just shock it up like this. Opens this door right here. And now I'm good to go. And I have, and then I don't, oh yeah, perfect. Anyone Check down here. Now I got the walls? acid gat kit part. And now... I need to go ahead and pass this guy. Grab the key. I was forget to grab the key also. Um, grabbing the key is kind of important. So then you grab the key, and then I'm gonna run down and uh, open this guy. And one thing I realized is right here. I just kind of just I cook a grenade and just kill myself, honestly, because there's no point. Oh shoot, I missed myself. Uh, I could run all, all the way back to the other side, and uh, but I don't have any perks, so it doesn't really matter if I down myself like this or if I use the the machine. So. That's kind of my take on it. I don't know if it's a negative or if it counts as a suicide or anything. Or a down. It probably counts as a down. Does it? Yeah, it ca does count it as a down, but I don't really care. Um, it's just for sheer laziness. I don't want to run back and forth and back and forth. But this is the magic right here, man. This is the cool part. I can go ahead and kill these guys as they come through. And, uh, and... Because when you, when you start that lawn, the washer thing... It it makes it so a lot more of these these guys will spawn in. So that's a nice fucking treat right that's there. That's a nice fucking treat right there. Uh, man, I didn't do it right. Oof. Usually try to shoot those guys like eight times. It's nice I got a max ammo. So and now I'm gonna grab this and then this is the cool part. This is the part I did the video on that that was really helpful. Um, instead of for first of all I, I did all that in round one and then I was able to make my way up here and grab the two X. This makes it so you get double points on these guys. Looks like it's time to And down. let's see, there's a whole bunch of them coming up here, so. Oh, Holy I crap. I just about got down already. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> I always just about get hit right here. Now I'm using this fancy new uh, scuff controller. I'm not really used to it yet, though, to be quite honest. <laughs> like, it's weird. The bumpers are weird for me. I'm trying to hurry and kill these guys because obviously my time's running out. I just got scared there at the beginning with all of the, uh, the times running out on the double kill. But check that out, dude. Round one, 6,000 points. That's what's up. This is the way to do it. If you guys didn't even know that about this yet, I'm sure a lot of you guys have saw my video. But um, if you didn't, dude, it's pretty epic that you could do this and get so many points from the beginning. So, uh, And then this is the other part that's tricky. And I did like a full like 20-minute tutorial on how to start the game. Um, so maybe if you guys didn't see that, you should check it out because it's kind of it's kind of neat. If you can start the game right, you can really end up in a good uh, a good spot. So that's kind of what I'm I'm doing here. But this isn't really a more of a walkthrough. This is just a live commentary. 
Um, see, yeah, look at this. I always have problems with some of these things sometimes. I don't know why. Oh, come on. Do you guys have this problem? Jesus. There goes my double up points then. I'm not going to be able to go back and get those double points. I'm going to barely make it back here. Oh, God. No fumbling. Oh, God. Oh, God. Zombies everywhere. Oh, Jesus. You gotta be shitting me. Ah, get out of here. I'm trying to run by them. Didn't work. I'm trying to go in here to see if there is the box. Yes, there you gotta is. See this. I think I just found Pandora's fucking box. This is stupid. This is not the way I wanted this done. Oh, the, a rocket? Ah, oh, balls. This is the worst. This is a horrible way to start, you know what I mean? But what can you do? Live commentary, live liveness. This is not the way that I wanted to do this. Oh my god. Really? A sniper in a rocket? I guess if they life gives you lemons. Double points. What a bunch of crap, dude. Now's our chance to make some real dough. Well, I'm not doing this right at all, but I'm at the point right now I don't care because I have a rocket. And a sniper. Oh, I'm gonna. I'll keep the sniper, I guess. All right. So now, now I'm already a round behind, because ideally I wanted to uh, buy round two. I would have grabbed a decent gun, not killed all those guys, not got down, and then run up here and open this door, because I want to kill the dudes in this area right here um, to uh, to make this guy pop out and get this part done. Usually you could get that done by round two. I'm telling you guys, it's the way to do it. Unfortunately, not everything works as planned sometimes. And now I'm here. And now I'm stuck. Tell me you're all seeing this, right? Trying to like feed the beast. Yeah. Keep killing freaks. Uh, I'm not a sniper by any means, so this is kind of fun. And I gotta kill these guys a little slower. See those two right here? The bodies are left here because I didn't. I killed them too quickly in a row. But at this point, I don't even care. I just don't want to die. Uh, I already got down off of some stupid stuff. So, come on, buddy. Welcome to the party. This is probably the hardest area, so I def definitely recommend this one first. Hey, buddy. Um, because this one is, uh, I think, I think it's the hardest one. Is he full yet? That should feed us. That should uh, quench his thirst. No? Jesus. A hungry little bugger. I think you have to feed him six dudes. No homo. Yeah, there you go. And now I'm just going to run around. Whoa, oh, hey, buddy. Don't we get some kind of reward? I'm going to run around that guy. I'm going to go back down here and grab the acid gap part. Man, I cannot believe how horrible of a start this was. But what can you do? Yeah, this part. The part's there, usually. It could be down here, or it could be down here. And I'll open this guy up later. You have to go out further in order to do that, so... You sure this is important, Weasel? Like, there's a lot of stuff that to build. It's just it's very noob friendly to a point. Once you learn everything, it's pretty pretty easy to get all the rest of it done. Like once you learn all of the the parts and where to to do everything, then the uh, like I, I failed already earlier and I already got down once and and I'm not. It's not over for me yet. I've been down twice because I killed my, down myself even um, on purpose. But, uh, but I, I mean, you could get like 20 downs and still make it to like round 30 because you get a new afterlife every single round. So kind of cool for the, for the noobs like myself. I'm not, I'm not a noob. 
I played a lot of zombies, but uh, I, I'm not like awesome at them, you know. I get scared when there's too many coming at me, and you know, I'm like one of those dudes. <laughs> uh, I guess I'll get this now. Too many, not too many dudes are spawned in yet, so. Come on, zombie man. I'm using this instead of the sniper because I want points now. I need to get enough points to get. I need 1,500, 1,000, and then 1,000. So, what is that? 3,500 to get to the next uh, item for the plane because we have, what, two right now? And then. Oh man, I gotta kill more of these guys up here. This totally sucks. Uh, and then I gotta get, uh, oh nice, I don't have to kill any more up here, I can get out! Get out of here! I'm out! Um, oh, but I have my three afterlives, I should have gone up to the roof, oh well. But, and I'm probably too late to be doing this, but I'm gonna go ahead and do it anyway, because I don't care. Blunder got upgrade kit right here, so I'll be able to upgrade, oh hey buddy, hey buddy. Um, and now it doesn't matter really what I do, because I just, I need to get enough points to get down to the other area. I know I'm going to run out of ammo, though, so there's going to be that problem. I know that the second day this came out, I had beaten Syndicate's um, round. I got around 30, 49, or 39 on this, and he only got to 37, but now he's, like, destroyed my record. I saw he was live streaming, and he's, like, he made it to, to like, the... Uh, round 70 or something I saw him say. I was like, what? I could not do round 70 on this thing. It would be crazy. Alright, four grand. Uh-oh, uh-oh. I'm going to go ahead and leave that guy and go take care of business over here. So I got the acid cat, uh, acid cat, acid gat kit. Built. I have two of the parts. I'm gonna go ahead and head down here. See, there's 1,500 for this door. Yeah, well, uh, 1,500. Well, I'll get 40 back for this. 60 back. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. Huh? 60 points. Miracle points. All right. So there was, there was 15, and there's a thousand, and there's another thousand down here that I have to get. And I want to get this one out of the way too, because this one's kind of a pain. You have to go back and forth and stuff, so. Um, and if you do this one when there's a lot of zombies around here, I always get trapped. And you always have to remember to do that and unlock it and then unlock this door. Otherwise, you're not going to be able to do it. Um, and then I still only have 1,200. I need 1,500 to get to the next door. And then another 1,500 after that. Ooh, hey, buddy. Nice. You got some reach. So I need another 3,000 in order to get through both of the other doors to get to the other devil dog head. And usually I can get it all done by round 6. Uh, if there's five, let's see here, four, one. Oh, five, ah! Four, I always just, like, kind of go all over the place. And you can see right there, it's flickering, and the thing drops down, that means it worked. I'm running into a wall in my afterlife mode. You'd think that I'd be able to run right by a wall in afterlife, but no, I get caught on the wall. It's embarrassing. Alright, Zombie Joe's over here. I'm running out of ammo. I would really need a max ammo right about now. And I gotta go, and I always forget this too. You gotta go get this part, otherwise it won't, um, it won't be here later. Sometimes the grit's right, the grid, uh, or grate, or whatever it is for this, um, shield part is right there against the wall, but it's not right now, of course. Hey, buddy. And then it's not there, it could be back there. Okay, so now it's in the other spot, now I know. Well, that sucks. So now I have to go back up. Don't hit me. I have to go back up and it's going to be right here. So it's one of three spots, and here's the spot it ended up being at. A few more parts, this could be something good! Hi. So now I need enough points to get through this next area. Uh, it sucks because I'm running out of uh, of ammo and all I have is a sniper and that thing. I need just enough to get in here. That way if I get downed, at least I can get back in this area. But ideally I don't want to get down because there's two areas I want to get through. So, uh, this is always a crapshoot part. Come at me, bros. Alright, so I'm going to open this one now. Looks like it needs power. Uh oh, I hear 
dude. Lateral. I just need a max ammo, maybe that'd be cool. Oh yeah, baby. I'm not done with you. Sweet! We got the guns and we got the bomb! I'm trying to run by these these Looney Tunes over there. There's a part of it on the wall. I open this. Now I can do all the things for the afterlife thing. So if I get down over here, I'm okay. That's uh, the mentality I have. Now I can kill these guys from a distance. Great. So I didn't get quite as much as a, as I wanted to get done here. Wait, I don't, I don't want to kill this guy yet. I know I should probably use that that thing, but I'm going to go ahead and down myself here because I want. I'm, I already have three afterlives, so I don't want to waste one of them. And I'm going to make this one work. There's two, three. And I'm going to run down here. Did I open it? Nope. Oh, crap. Well, I don't have enough time now. I was going to go get Juggernaut, but didn't happen because I don't want to die all right and now I'm there might as well go grab this part back here while I'm here and the other thing all right we've got the oxygen tanks. Right. What's and that? then this guy right here this is a piece of hey, somebody and I ain't talking about shit all right and then there's one last guy over here I'm going to grab this last part, and then I'm going to go ahead and end this episode, and we'll pick up part two after this. I think I'll hold on to this. Maybe I'll figure out now I just need to kill this guy out here, buy this guy, and we'll be good, and the next round will start. And this is the end of part one. Check back for part two soon. Peace, guys.